Hey guys, it's me, Shani, and today I wanted to show you my bookshelf here. And let me zoom out a little bit. Um, I want to do a full makeup room tour, but I thought it would be super fun to kind of do a more in-depth uh, look at my bookshelf here. The bookshelf itself is from Target and it was pretty affordable. You can just kind of like put the different shelves in the way you want, um, I believe, at least for the last couple. Um, but I think it was maybe 30, 40 bucks. And I just wanted to talk through it. So up here, <laughs> it's hard to see. Um, up there I have that little lash uh, canvas that is from either TJ Maxx or Marshall. That purse is from my mom. It's like a pur purple purse. I don't think it's anything that fancy, but I thought it was cute on display up there. And then I have my Thrive Cosmetics little hat that I just have up there as well. Then the top shelf, I have a little bit of a princess theme. I have this acrylic or little clear uh, organizer with a ton of makeup brushes in it. I have Sonia Kashuk, Real Techniques, random, just random ones. These are kind of my extra ones. They're not my everyday ones, but I do grab for these ones occasionally. And so we have like more colorful ones, random face ones, random eye ones, and then random like these types of brushes. So those are there. And then I have this little um, Funko Pop, I believe it's called. This is the Cinderella's Carriage one that my boyfriend got me for our anniversary, uh, one of our anniversary gifts a while back. And so it's super cute. I think it's adorable with the little horses there. And then my mom got me these little Cinderella figures um, a while back. And so I have Cinderella here and Prince Charming there. And then the Sigma Beauty um, Disney Princess Cinderella palette collection. You know, I kept the little box, and so that is the box there. And then we have this tiara I got from um, Etsy. And not sure what uh, shop from Etsy, but I got it from Etsy for the Audrey Hepburn Halloween costume that I did. And then this photo frame here, I believe is from TJ Maxx and it is pink with these little flowers. And then there is a picture of me at a castle. And I just, I don't know, I love, I loved this vacation. This was for our, my boyfriend and I's three year anniversary. We went and stayed at a castle and it's just really good memories. And I thought it was, Cute for the princess shelf here. So that is that one. And then down here we have a little Thrive Cosmetics shelf. So I have my Thrive Cosmetics water bottle, my little bag that says my life isn't perfect but my eyeshadow is. So cute. We have this little antique teacup I got from an antique store. It has a little chip in it in the back but it, I think it's really cute. Uh, it's like a mini teacup. I have a Littlest Pet Shop that uh, my boyfriend and I randomly found in the in the beach, in the water at a beach in Virginia. And I don't know, I used to love Littlest Pet Shops, so I have it as like a memory of our time in Virginia um, from a while back. So that's really cute. I got this mirror here from Dollar Tree. It was black and I actually painted it turquoise and I really like how it looks. I just kind of set it there. We have a little thing that from Thrive Cosmetics there with some words and a heart. And then I have a lipstick, a powder, and then this super cute shopping cart is from Hobby Lobby. It is a little pink one. And I have some more goodies there. And then this was just a little tea uh, packet that 
a piece of tea, yeah, not a piece of tea, a tea bag came in from an antique store and I thought this was really cute. It says life is a journey, enjoy the ride with a teacup and so I have that kind of over here. Next level, we have some antiques and just random things. So I have this from Hobby Lobby. It is a super adorable carousel and the bottom actually, where does it open up? There we go. The bottom opens up to put like a ring in it, but how adorable. My boyfriend got me this and I just love it. It's so girly and cute. I have an antique back here. This is a powder tin from the 30s. Check out my vintage makeup collection video if you want to know more about the vintage makeup in my collection. So we have here a little vintage lipstick holder from the 50s with two lipsticks from the 50s. And then these are two new Besame lipsticks. So it's a mixture of um, new and old lipsticks. We have a vintage Max Factor compact, which I love. And this, I believe, is from TJ Maxx, the little gold, either TJ Maxx or Target, the little gold container here. And I have my Glam Light Cake palette in the back. I have three Anastasia palettes in the front, my two Likely Makeup blush palettes, the Clown blush and the Fairy blush. And then behind those are two and two, so four, um, ooh, <laughs> four, can't really tell, but for um, ColourPop palettes in the back there. But just some random palettes that I like that I have on display. And then this wooden mirror is was a project for one of my theater classes in college. And basically I had to do a, a um, take a prop from the theater room and create it to, uh, to identify or to represent a musical more of a play that we were that we were reading and it was called a doll's house I believe and I created this piece I kind of put all these little eyeballs and glitter in this mirror and I think it's just super cool and it's one of my favorite memories of college I feel like so I have that there it's kind of saying like you look into the mirror but you're seeing what other people want you to be very very fun college project back there i have a little picture of audrey hepburn this is from vintage doll cosmetics when i bought their little lipstick their audrey lipstick i have the bridgerton pat mcgrath box because i think it's gorgeous and then this little mushroom thing here that i got at a dollar store a long time ago so that is that let's go to the bottom one this is my vintage makeup little section we have a bunch of antiques here antique makeup or vintage makeup this little tiny perfume it's not gonna focus <laughs> isn't that adorable i have that i have um some compacts an old rouge from the 40s cake mascara we have a little pamphlet there and then the Avon 70s perfume box just on display I have a vintage ad I have color I'm sorry not color but cover girl little 80s eyeshadow some more compacts and powders powder puffs from the 50s definitely check out my um, vintage makeup collection if you want to look at all these products and learn more about them. We have this super amazing cigar box and the person who kind of sold it had put these little legs on it and this thing right here super cute and then in here I keep my liquid lipsticks and I do have a video going through all of these and swatching them on my channel if you're interested but it's just so cute it says the award goes to and there's old Hollywood figures <laughs> it's just really really cute so that's this 
shelf. And then lastly, we have at the bottom here, we have a bunch of books. I have more books than this, most definitely on makeup and stuff, but um, these are just the ones I have. I have my Sleeping Beauty Besame Cosmetics palette here. Love that palette. I have some just miscellaneous makeup books. And then this is a cream or serum blush from M Cosmetics in the shade Rose Milk. I really enjoy this and it's just kind of on display here. I have a vintage compact from V Vanity. Just kind of there. <laughs> Another little mushroom. We have this gorgeous Egyptian sculpture or I don't know figure that I got in an antique store. I just think it's really cool and I like to put it next to my Juvia's Place palette which is in this mini shopping cart. It's not as mini as the one up there but it is really cute and my one of my best friends Meredith got me this little um shopping cart and I keep all my Juvia's Place palettes in there or most not all of them but a lot of them and then I have my vintage ads in the back. We have a Max Factor one with Lucille Ball on it and this one from Cody, I believe. Or is it? Yeah, I think it's Cody. And then, so those are just kind of in the background. And then back here, I have the Ulta Beauty and Gilmore Girls little eyeshadow duo thought that was cute but it's kind of in the back you can't really see it and then lastly I think we have this gorgeous carriage Avon 70s little perfume bottle and this was a gift from one of my co-workers and I absolutely love it so that is there so that is it. I just kind of wanted to go through every single piece here in my, in my, on my bookshelf. I love displaying things. I think it's so fun and this is what it looks like now. And I hope you enjoyed. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.